So we're going to be looking at the os coxae, and specifically the os ilium. So the os coxae is actually split into three different bones. You have the os ilium, the os ischi, and the os pubis. Um, and in between these three bones is a socket for the hip joint. Uh, and that joint is the articulatio coxae. Uh, this socket is called the acetabulum and can be seen here. Um, inside that is the fossa acetabuli, which you can see there. And surrounding that is the fascius lunata acetabuli, which can be seen as this white area here. The, the top ridge is called the limbus acetabuli, here. And the acetabulum opens inferiorly by the incisura acetabuli, which can be seen here. So the os ilium lies superiorly to the acetabulum, and it starts with the corpus osus ili, which is here. The lateral face of the os ilium is called the ala osus ili, which is just this face here. Uh, specifically on this face, you have the fascius glutea, which is here. And surrounding this, there are three different lines. You have the linea glutea anterior, which can be seen here. You have the linea glutea posterior, which can be shown along here. And then if we turn, you should be able to see the linea glute glutea inferior, which runs along down here. So the anterior edge of the os ilium is called the crista iliaca, which runs along the top all the way along here. And this ends on the anterior side with the spina iliaca anterior superior, which can be seen just here. And below this is the spina iliaca anterior inferior, which is here. So therefore, on the other side of the spina iliaca, you have the spina iliaca posterior superior, here, and the spina iliaca posterior inferior, which is here. And then just below that, you have the incisura ischiatica maior, which is this part along here. So, if we turn around to the medial face, we can first of all see a groove in it, just here. And this is called the fossa iliaca. Also on this side, you'll see the fascius sacropelvina, which is this part here, and it attaches the os coxae to the sacrum. Specifically on this, you have the fascius auricularis, which is this white part along here. And then just next to it, you have the tuberositus iliaca, which is this region here. The os ilium is separated from the os ischi by the linea arcuata. And this can be seen as the line that runs down from the fascius sacropelvina, it runs down here towards the tuberculum pubicum, which is here. 